Welcome back once again to the Tech of Tomorrow YouTube channel, bringing you tomorrow's tech today. And once again, we're bringing you guys something really cool. Today, we're gonna to do the unboxing and first features look at the new MSI Ravager case. That's right, the Ravager, like a dinosaur, something scratching in the ass and you go, ooh. But no, this is actually a mid-tower case coming to a market at about $99, should be available on the net everywhere. With that, let's start looking at the outside of the box and seeing some of the stuff that it's got. So. So, like always, we'll just take a look at the front of the box. Gonna spin it around, let you guys see the side of the box. You guys can see some of the features that are on there. Not gonna break them all down, just let you guys take a look because you guys can read. I hope you can read. If not, stay in school. All right, that's my kitty advice for the day. Let me flip around so I should go to the other side of the box. You guys can see all that. Show all the various features and stuff all the way down. So it's going to be USB. Now, one of the big things about this entire case that the guy told me, the rep from over there, he told me that the thing's supposed to have really excellent cable management. So let me start with my little trusty knife. And with that, I'm going to go ahead and make the first incisions up in here. I'll lean this over so you get the camera to take a look. I'm going to make it a quick incision here. It's professionally done. Don't try this at home. I am a doctor. I'm going to go ahead and make another one over here. Got the knife here in my hands. Now I'm going to throw the knife and stick the camera with it. No? He says no. All right. Well, okay. He really takes the fun out of these unboxing I'm telling you. So, all right, we'll start off on top. And right up on top, we've got a little MSI customer survival pack. So let me walk this over so the camera can get a little closer shot of that. These are survival packs. So it's, you know, obviously going to contain water, a medical kit, you know, things to clean radiation out of the air. You know, survival kit. I don't know. Let's open it up and see what's in it. Oh, all right, cool. So let's check it out. All the screws and everything for the case right here. These are all the things to lock in your bays and all that stuff. Those are right here. Got a bunch of tie down straps right here. And then something cool down here in the bottom. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, check it out. This shit comes with some bling. Hell yeah. That's right, I got my bling. I got my MSF bling. Let me walk this shit over the camera so y'all can take a closer look. Hold on. That's right. So, you guys all saw that. That's all the stuff. It comes with this stuff, this stuff, and obviously the MSI Bling. So, I got the MSI Bling. It's your survival kit. Now, um, what this survival kit is for, they weren't going to tell you, but in the future, MSI is organizing work gang and work forces, and if you don't have the necklace on, they suck you into their gang and make you work slavery. That's right. That's what's happening. Don't believe me? You know, you guys will see. All right. Well, let me yank off some bling because I don't want people to get the wrong idea and think I'm a rapper. So I'll go ahead and put this off the side, set it down, go ahead and turn the case box upside down. Go ahead and get that out of the way. We can get some good sound effects here. I'm going to take the box now. The box goes up. Oh, boom. It's right. We roll around here. Bring this thing around. Pull off the bottom part, which, yes, will go effectively at the cameraman. That's right. Nothing you can do about that. All right. Well, let's start off and let's look at the bottom. So I'm opening it up. Right at the bat, we can see we got four rubberized feet right on the bottom right here. One, two, three, four. Also, we have... <laughs> now, these are some of the cheesiest little grill filters I've ever seen. They're removable, but I got to say, these are kind of cheesy. They just stick in here and they almost feel like paper. I mean, I suppose they'll work, but um, that is a kind of a, I don't know, that particular one's a semi-cheesy design, but hey, it's only 99 bucks. We've got two of those on there. Just flip that over there, show you guys that. Two of those little things. You can also fit fans in the bottom, so you'd have intake fans, hence why they have these here. If you're sucking the air and you don't want the dust to get sucked in your system along with that. So go ahead and pop it around, flip the thing up and around, and here we go. Up and around we go where she stops, nobody knows. Well, I know. All right, once more at the cameraman. Got him. All right, so let's take it out of the box. Kaboom. So we'll start off and we'll flip it around. You guys can see that there's a bunch of these little Ravenger claw marks. Rah, rah, rah. Got one, two, three bays, obviously right here in front. Got our start button. Nice and simple there. Take a look here. I'm going to flip it up now. Let you guys see the top. See, we've got 
two USB 2.0, two USB 3.0, headphone, mic, and the reset button, all located up here on top. Up here on top again, we see a place for additional fans, and once again, a grill. This one's not exactly removable. Flip it around, let you guys see the side. Guys can see once again, plenty of room for fans here. The big claw mark across the side again with the Ravager logo out here. I kind of like that sound. It's a Ravager. That's my sound of a Ravager coming to get you, you know? So every time you unbox a Ravager, as soon as you open the box, you hear it. It's going to kill my throat later, man. All right, so we'll start off flipping around, showing you guys the back. We can see we do have a couple things for water. They're very small. Power supply on the bottom. All blue things here on the rear. You can fit one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Also a fan in the back, it's blue. You guys can see it in there, it's got the MSI logo on it. Flip it around over here, show you guys the other side, or once again, we get the claw stripe. Now, let's start to take the thing apart. What we always do here, we take shit apart. So, front panel, removable. Guys, you see all that? All the wires are all wired up there. We have a fan here. Once again, with another removable grill pop. You can see this, it pops off. There's a fan right there. Just pop the grill back on. Very nice and simply. So I'm just gonna go ahead and put this back on, folks, so there's really no reason to keep it off now. You guys see it comes off very easily. Goes back on. Now. Okay, so now that we've took out the front panel, we've seen what everything looks on the outside. Let's actually go inside and see the inside of the beast. Whoa, as I dropped a little screw on the table. Makes a nice clackety sound. You guys love the sound effects. Clackety clack. Don't come back. Pull this little side door off. There we go. Show you guys that. Get that out of the way. Go ahead and show you this. Sorry, I don't mean to have a little delay there, folks. I'm just trying to take this thing apart nicely. Let's take a look inside. Get the camera to come up here. You can see that all these bays, very easily, so flexible. Put your drive inside of there, just a nice flexible bay. I like these kind. They're very, very easy to use. All the bays here, put your drives in. You just lock it in place and put it back inside. Very simply done. No problem at all with that. Go ahead and pop that back in there. Inside, plenty of room. There's actually no sharp edges whatsoever. Everything feels pretty good. Now, I'm sorry to say that Rodney Reynolds would not give this a kick-ass thing. Let me show my foot for Rodney. A kick-ass thing because there's no removal of motherboard tray. So Rodney would say, screw this case. But I mean, hey, I think it's okay because let's spin it around and show you the back. Remove motherboard case in the old days was because you couldn't access anything around your zip. But you see you've got plenty of room back here, holes here, here, and here, and plenty of room all the way in the back here for cable management. So they weren't lying about that. There's lots and lots of room back here on the Ravenger for cable management. So, so you guys see it. This is the unboxing and first features look of the new MSI Ravenger, a case that's very ergonomic. You guys can see it has plenty of room for cable management in the back, plenty of bays, Plenty of expansions, USB 3.0, no reboot motherboard tray. But hey, who really cares about that? I think for $99, this is actually a pretty hot product here on Tech of Tomorrow. So thanks for watching. We'll see you guys later. We got to go and do some ravaging of ourselves. Ah!